Hi everyone and welcome back to Me Talk TV. It's Raina and I'm so happy to be back on this screen joining, having you all to join me on today. Y'all, today I'm just happy. I'm, ex I'm back and y'all know I've been under the weather. I've been sick, not feeling well. Um, so that's one of the reasons why I have not been on this camera, okay? But I'm like, let me get back to my people out there. Um, and I do want to go over some of these, um, I just want to, I just want to read some of y'all's comments and all of that. Um, and I thank y'all for the well wishes, everyone who wished me well to get better. Thank you. Thank you so much. If you want to see this video, the rest of it, then follow me. Okay. I'm back and y'all, I'm just going to go over some of these questions. And like I said, I thank every one of you all for um, your well wishes, all of that. I'm feeling better. Um, I did go and get a test done, but y'all, I have yet to see the results or anything because listen, it's a lot of people did not get their results back and we're still waiting, like what's going on. Um, and it's kind of pushing everything else back. Like, but anyway, I'm not going to worry about it. I'm just going to let leave it in the hands of the Lord and let him do what he do. Um, and I'm praying that I don't have it. Y'all pray for me too. Um, that, that everything is clear. Um, so who's this Tavern's view? Something, I don't know. I hope I'm saying it right. Uh, Ten Veers or something like that. Name of steamer, please. Listen, y'all, I will have that steamer linked at the bottom. Okay, so all you have to do is click on it. Okay, it's right at the bottom in the description. I keep getting everybody asking about the steamer. All you have to do is go down to my Amazon affiliate link at the bottom and you can get your steamer, okay? Um, it would have the name of the steamer and all. So, okay. Um, wow. I don't, a lot of these uh, comments, I don't see. Like, what is going on? Like, why are they not giving me my comments the way that I need them to give them to me? Okay. But I know I received some comments. And now I'm not seeing them on here. Like, where are they? Uh, but anyway, we're going to just go ahead and talk about these big bugs, y'all. But this year, I have something planned different. I'm trying to set up some stuff, but then I end up getting sick. So it's like, really like, what what's going on? Um, but yes, I have something planned because this is me talk TV. So this is like a talk show. So I need to figure something out. Okay, but we're going to, I'm going to just go over this, um, for the newbies that's still coming in, uh, steps of how to make sure that your bed bugs are gone. You don't have no more for needle, all of that jazz, um, and how to keep from getting them again. Um, so first things first, you want to check the foundation. You want to make sure that, you know, wherever they're coming from, that that's where you can get rid of them. Because if you check their foundation, then you're 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 bound to get rid of them okay so make sure that you are finding where they have started from um make sure you starting outside with your baking soda but you need to get that foundation under control first because if you don't then that's gonna be hard to get rid of because you got to start with the foundation you just have to um so you can get rid of these bugs um if you don't want no infestation, especially because these things, they multiply so fast that you just can't sit down on them. You have to get up, you have to do something about it, or you're just going to have an infestation. So the best thing to do is get up, get your steamer and get it in your hand and get the steaming. Okay. Um, also, there's other things you can do as well, like the baking soda and the alcohol those are the three things that will absolutely help you get totally completely rid of bed bugs okay but i like to start off with that steamer because they they just drop dead as soon as you put the steamer on them they drop dead and i'm it, it would get rid of the eggs and everything but you have to go down to their level so what i'm saying is you have to go down into that rug area put that steamer on that rug area 
and steam your carpet because I believe that's one of the things that I wasn't doing. And I was like, well, why is it taking such a, a time to get rid of these bugs? But once I got down to that level, honey, I took that steamer and went around the carpet inside of the, you know, just, hey. And I know it's a handheld, but still, I got down there, y'all. I did not care. I was like, I'm getting rid of these bugs once and for all. I don't care what happens. I'm getting rid of them. But that's how you have to be. You cannot be lazy. Um, when you see one, you just sit there and don't do nothing. You can't do that. You have to get up and and, and you got to spray. You got to... When I say spray, I'm talking about the alcohol. But you have to get up and steam these bugs right then. If you have not gotten your hands on a steamer, I will have it linked down there for you. My Amazon affiliate link. Come on, y'all. Go ahead. Get your steamer so you can start. The sooner you start, the better it'll be because you can get rid of these bugs very quickly. Oh, that kind of rhymed, didn't y'all? But <clears throat> I'm just saying, if you want to get rid of them and you you know what i'm saying you're serious about this you won't be lazy you'll get up you'll just do it and um yeah because that's how i was i but i took everything off my couches i shouldn't have done that i wish i would not have done that because it damaged my couches i took the stuff off and washed it y'all <clears throat> and i shouldn't have done that now i realize that listen i didn't have to do that because all i had to do was steam all I had to do was spray the alcohol. All I had to do was get the baking soda, which I did not put baking soda down in my couches. The only place I put the baking soda was on my rugs, like around in the cracks, the crevices, you know, of each room and all of that. Um, I didn't have to do it in my couches and all of that jazz. I just sprayed my couches with alcohol and steamed and all of that. And I got rid of them. And I want you out there to get rid of them too as well. Y'all, it's been it's been such a journey right now, uh, dealing with the the sickness, y'all. And I was like, I gotta get back here uh, in 2022 so I can help y'all in 2022 because we're gonna get rid of these y'all are anyway. I'm already done. I don't have no more. But y'all gonna get rid of these in 2022. If y'all have any suggestions out there. Please let me know um, what y'all want from me. What do y'all want? Because I want to do that, okay? Um, also, if you have not already subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Become a part of this family, a family that helps. Because that is just what we are all about over here, helping each other out. Um, and I know some of y'all in the comments, y'all get down there and y'all tell people how um, other ways that you can get rid of bed bugs. And I really appreciate that. I really do. Um, but this is a sure way to get rid of these bed bugs is the steamer, um, is the alcohol, is, and, um, also the baking soda. This is a sure way to get rid of them. Like I said, this really makes me happy to know that there's people being helped out there, you know? Um, and I have people out there vouching the saying, yeah, this is working. Because it truly is. Um, and I know in one of the videos I was talking about, I had the iron, y'all. I had the iron. But the iron is not fast enough, y'all. The iron is not... You have to keep pushing the button just to get that steam. And you just don't want to keep doing that. You want to make sure that your steam is just flowing. And that's what the, the steamer does. It just flows. And so that helps you to get rid of the bugs. Because the steam, the heat, once it hits that... Them bed bugs, it, it's just, they cannot survive. They cannot survive like that. So that is why I keep telling y'all to get the steamer, to get the steamer. Um, and, <clears throat> I, I, and now I got it like I, I have it easier for you guys to where you can just go down there, click it, buy it, purchase it from my Amazon affiliate link. So just take the time out, do that, um, and you will be home free. You will be on your journey to being big, but free. Okay. Um, so I am so, so, like I said, excited to be coming back in front of this camera, talking to you guys and, and so happy that, you know, it just made my heart melt when everybody was like, we hope you get well soon. We hope you feel better. It does a lot. You just don't know. A lot of people don't know. It does a lot for you when you have people caring for you like that, you know, 
this is my job. This is my business. This is, I have to do this if I want to get paid. So yeah, but I love it. I really do love it, you know, um, but I do want to change up some things this year, make some things better this year. So I'm so, so excited again that you have joined me on today. If you have not checked out any of the latest videos, go ahead. Um, you can go up in the card section and there always will be another video for you to watch at the end of the video. So make sure that you are staying all the way to the end of the video so you can capture more videos at the end. Okay. So I'm so glad again. Thank you so much. And I will be trying to start up a series or something this this week um if not this week next week i will be starting up a series so i can stay in front of this camera with you guys and you can see my smiling face come on y'all we got to be smiling because we are alive we are well even though i've been sick a little bit but i'm still well i'm still here you know god is good all the time no matter what's going on in our lives so I love you guys. Be blessed. And I'll see you in my next video.